Hi friends. It's me, host Eric. You're not looking at me at the moment, you're looking at my friends here and I'm talking to the same people in the raw room. Currently, if I had the audio on, you'd hear what they're saying and they're having conversations about whatever they're having conversations about. I don't know at the moment because I have the audio turned off so I can talk to you. There's a picture of Yaylor. So light bulb, right at a beautiful moment, decides to show us a picture of Yaylor. And Yaylor, of course, is the demigod of never wrong and the center of the Yaylorian religion. Now, I'm Pastor Eric. Um, probably the world's foremost expert on Yaylorianism. I've tried it for half the lore again. I'm so. But, the moral of the story is everybody knows who the lore is. Why? Because it's a community that shares a history a mythology a big set of commonalities that they can refer to all which are generated here and what is called the raw room now what is but how do you get in here what is, what, do you, what is this thing here well I'm a quick link go to GDM you can get in there easily enough it's not difficult to get to. There's a link on almost every video I put up that has that. But the better question is, where does it end up? That's the Lake Victoria. Where's the Nile? Well, the Nile, and or the ocean it dumps into, is here, TWFE Raw. Every 15 minutes, up pops a video of people having meaningful conversations about their lives and about ideas and about all sorts of stuff. And it's kind of a bit of a grab bag. What what are you going to get in one of these videos? It depends. Sometimes you get me screaming at people. Sometimes you get people screaming at me. Sometimes you get me getting taken to the woodshed because I overstepped or something. I mean, I get checked as much as anybody. Um, maybe to say it's my channel it is correct. But primarily what that means is I'm the one who pays for the things. It's not, it's not making me any money or anything. But I don't care because look at this. How fantastic is this? Now it's Friday night and there are currently in this room without me there. Or I mean I'm here but I'm not. I'm just watching. There are 17 people plus the bot. I think there's one bot now I said two. If I'm correct, yeah. And uh, that includes me. But we've got six people on camera. We've got light bulbs, I NFJ woman, Audra, another woman. It's good to have two women in the mix. Sometimes we have three, sometimes we have a majority of women. We got a decent split of genders here. We have people who find the space safe and comfortable to hang out in, to talk about ideas and to know that the right kind of boundaries will always be respected, protected, and enforced. So and additionally that I have the capacity to do that that as host Eric I can go in there and roll in there and, and bust chops as I need to and yet also be accountable and not any different than anybody else when it comes to being accountable for getting my chops busted it's a social optimization engine in which individuals come in with their respective identities and um, and learn to do those identities better to the maximum of their ability. Pepsi here in the left hand corner. He's an ENTP like me and I was just coming in here for that to do this to talk to him about his Yalorian fighting rituals video that he made as a, as a part of this whole meta project where talking to people is designed to manifest those sort of group mythologies and group ideas in ways that are permanent. So we, every conversation is in the raw channel. It's always recorded 24-7, 365. You can participate for free. You can lurk for as long as you want. If a space opens up in the six boxes that are available, you can jump right in there and be on camera and talk right away. It's fair. It's extremely fair and it's extremely protective. Here's the deal. According to what rules or central thing that you can point to and look at, it's according basically to my to my
designation that everyone try to be decent, including me, and that means uh, being willing to sit there and listen to somebody tell you why you're not being decent and if you're not. And so, um, it's a pretty unique space. I hope if you're watching this and you've not experienced anything regarding talking with famous people before, that you check it out. Go to GTM. That's GTM. Dot talking with famous people dot com. If you just want to lurk and participate in the chat, the chat's always going on. Shit's going down in the chat. Sometimes they're teasing us. Sometimes we're responding to their stuff. Sometimes we're ignoring it. Whatever. I'm usually on camera. Regardless, I really do seriously hope you'll join us one of these times if you've not done so before. And you'll find it easy squeezy. Nothing too demanding intellectually, philosophically, spiritually, or ethically, nothing demanding at all, tries to provide, as I said, a good space for discourse and to enforce fair and honest discourse rules across the board, including when they land against me. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to eat plenty of cheese. See you next time in the Raw Room here on Talking with Famous People.